This keyboard will make you a better gamer, or at least that's what Ten says. Well, it's called a, a Wooting 60 HE. This keyboard gives you a competitive advantage, and I'm not even joking. But I think we can do better for your money. You see, the Wooting 60 HE is actually really dated in terms of the keyboard technology that it uses, and it's actually not offering you very much for your money. It uses a universal tray mounting system, which is really only used for the cheapest boards, and it doesn't even know where they came from, attributing it to a keyboard forum site instead of, you know, the people who actually invented it. And the case is fully plastic with very cheap keycaps and a steel plate, which is not going to sound good. So I did some digging and I found something that I think is much better quality for your money. This is the Boog 75, and while I know the name leaves a lot to be desired, I promise you it delivers so much more than the Wooting. It uses the exact same technology as the Wooting, down to having the same manufacturer for the Hall effect switches. It allows for variable actuation points that you can set in the software, and allows you to set the actuation points of individual switches, just like the Wooting. But where it starts to kick the absolute out of the Wooting is when it comes to the fact that this is a gasket mounted alu case with an aluminum plate instead of a steel plate. It also sounds like this, stock. It also comes with very high quality thick double shot PBT keycaps versus the very cheap shine through laser etched PBT keycaps on the Wooting. If you want a similar quality in terms of thickness of PBT keycaps on the Wooting, it's only die sub which can eventually wear out versus the double shotting on the Boog. And did I mention with this keycap upgrade on the Wooting, the price between the Wooting and the Boog is almost exactly the same. And the Boog is actually in stock versus the four month wait time on the Wooting 60HE. The Boog 75 is also compatible with the Zoom 75 cases because it comes from the same maker. So if you already have a Zoom 75, they do offer just the module for sale, but that is only compatible with their already existing Zoom 75 board. This means that if you don't like the aesthetic or the color options offered for the Boog, you can take the Zoom 75, buy that, and put the module in that. But that will be significantly more expensive. Now I will admit, the Wooting 60HE has a module that slots into literally any tray mount case. So if you want to buy the module just to use in a case that you already have, go for it. But if you're buying pre-built, the Boog is the way to go. Now before you think I'm just talking up the Boog, there is one downside besides the name you can't set individual keys LED color. I'm so sorry, I know, it just ruins it for you. But if you can get past that, it's the same or better in every single way I can find. And the pricing is super comparable. Now I wanna acknowledge the keyboards are super preference-based. At the end of the day, what you like is what you like, and I'm not gonna fight you on that. But I do think that the Boog offers the exact same performance in gaming while offering a much better typing experience overall at almost exactly the same price as the Wooting 60 HE while fulfilling much quicker as well. Let me know what you think. Let me know if you have any questions. Let me know if you think I missed anything. And I've left a link you know where if you wanna check it out for yourself. I'll see you next time. Happy typing.